How was it keeping this whole thing secret? <laughs> we did a very good job. Uh, <laughs> obviously. Yeah, obviously, right? Uh, it was hard, but we had each other to lean on, so yeah. that was good. I mean, we saw each other every other week, long weekends, mm-hmm. um, yeah. lots of FaceTime, lots yeah. of phone calls. And, uh, you know, like she said, we just kind of leaned on each other and mm-hmm. got through it. How are you doing today? I'm okay. Are you? You're not. I'm sorry. I just want to go. Yeah, you know, but that's like in any heartbreak. I mean, all you want to do is just be in your bed and, like, curled up and maybe have a tub of ice cream. (laughs) But I wasn't able to do that. So when Chris is asking me, like, in that moment, I'm just like, when I was saying I want to go home, that's what I wanted to do. (laughs) So luckily, after the rose ceremony that day, I got a lot of clarity because I was able to have time alone. And then that's when I, I really reflected on both relationships. Um, I just stayed true to, you know, how I felt for her and how I felt about the process. And, you know, I've said it over and over again, and I just did a really good job compartmentalizing everything. So, you know, Mm -hmm. Des and I in relationship was one thing, and, you know, Brooks and my relationship was another, and hers and Brooks was another. And I just did a really good job keeping all that separate the entire time. So, um, you know, whether that's easy or not for everybody, I don't know, but He's pretty easy going. I'm pretty easy going. And I think he was just confident in what we had so yeah he didn't lose that which yeah. i'm thankful for <laughs> thank you uh would you like to dance <laughs> <laughs> to be honest he was always like perfect for me but it almost was so easy that it's like well, why is he so perfect for me <laughs> uh, you know what i mean because you almost want to like dig for more just to see if it's going to be harder like if it's going to be a chase but he wasn't because everything was just so natural. And um, so once Brooks left and I had to really dig deep with both relationships of Drew and Chris, um, there was just so much that I wanted, you know, like I didn't want to ever say goodbye to him. And that's when I knew, like, he's the one. <laughs> She's never saying goodbye. I'm never saying goodbye. Ever. <laughs>